Hi, it's Daniel. I want to tell you what I've, what I've learned about electricity. First, I'm going to tell you what the purpose of a circuit is. The purpose of the circuit is to make energy or electrons travel around something like this. There's stuff called receivers like like um, these, these light bulbs, or DSIs, or even this buzzer. And there are conductors, sort of like the, the wires, or paper clips. There are also sources, which are, what are, which are D-cells, and this, is, this represents a D-cell. There, there are also insulators, sort of like maybe plastic cups or cardboard and stuff like that. Sponges, sponges, uh, plastic, cardboard, ETC. Well, what is, now I'm going to tell you what a circuit is. A circuit is something like this, a drawing of a plan or a schematic diagram. Now I'm going to tell you about my schematic diagram that me and my group made. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Well, we use the foil so the energy can transmit through and not just stop because cardboard is an insulator and that's what's holding the cup. This is a switch, so in case for some reason it doesn't turn off, you can just turn the switch off and turn the switch on if you want it to turn on if you turned it off before or turn it off because this is a switch. Well, we use these paper clips because these are alligator wires, so they like sort of bite on stuff like that. And these are the lights we used. Um, we did a, those, that's in the shape of a parallel circuit. So like if one piece falls off, off not everything turns off. If like um, maybe this falls off, this will still light on, keep on lighting on. And But if this falls off, that one keeps on lighting on. So it's sort of like a backup system. And this is our one buzzer. These are our 2D cells, and here's one up here. That's our ring. We just did it because it's conductor, and in case that doesn't work, we have a wire in between. And then that's that's my schematic diagram, me and my group's schematic diagram. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching again. Bye.